By now, you should have read Writing Short Creative Nonfiction, which is Chapter 3 in our textbook, Creative Writing, Four Genres in Brief, by David Starkey. These two short videos are meant not as substitutes, but as supplements to that required reading. Please remember that you can now access your textbook by visiting the website of the Cerritos College Bookstore, which has partnered with Redshelf to provide free electronic copies. So, what is creative nonfiction? Think of it like this. The story is factual. The storytelling is fictional. That is, the writers of creative nonfiction employ the techniques of writers of fiction in order to give their works a more literary quality. As with the writers of fiction, then, the writers of nonfiction are particularly concerned with character, point of view, setting, structure, exposition, action, and resolution, and dialogue. Their goal is to shape real-life events with these fictional storytelling techniques to create factual, yet also literary stories. For our first example of creative nonfiction, let's carefully consider Savages, which is an excerpt from Frank Conroy's memoir, Stop Time. You may remember Conroy as the author of the essay, The Writer's Workshop, which we read earlier this semester. As we read Savages, let's pay particular attention to Conroy's detailed descriptions of the character of Teddy and the setting of Fremont in the exposition of his story, his suspenseful narration of the action of junior boys running loose on the grounds for most of the night, and the thoughtful resolution of his story in the last paragraph of the excerpt. 